What's up? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a great day. And if you're new to my channel, welcome to the dark side. Because I am showing you guys how to download and install CC Houses for The Sims 4. Now, this is a video I told you I was going to redo a while ago, and I just keep forgetting, so... My bad. Uh, if you're playing new to my channel, hi, how you doing? Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and don't forget to turn your notification bell so you know when a new post is updated. And don't forget to follow your girl on Instagram at ismetroy. I'm trying to reach 2,000 followers. And uh, don't forget to hit the like button and let me know you enjoyed this video. Let's go ahead and get into this video. Praline Sims. Now, Praline Sims is actually a duo, I believe. Um, a sister duo, one person covers, you know, all the sim stuff, you know, makeup and accessories and stuff, and the other person, uh, take care of the, the lots, if, you know, we're gonna go ahead and put it there, pray, is it an I there, praline, I don't think so, okay, yeah, here we go, praline sims, alright, I'm leaving some links down below of some other houses you can download, especially the ones that I have in my game, that I just don't use anymore, they're beautiful, um, I'm gonna go just, I'm gonna go to her, her profile real quick. Here we go. Hi, how you doing? Yeah. But make sure you guys check out Praline Sims, not just for houses, but like overall. I've linked them before in my videos. So yeah, go, make sure you go there. Okay, so here we go. Uh, ooh, gamma. Now some of the houses are fully CC, which means it has a lot of custom content. House, house, okay. Houses from Praline Sims, I believe other creators will have uh alpha like complete alpha so make sure you double check and make sure which uh is it max's match is it base game compatible is it alpha cc in the house depending on what you actually download because once you start using cc houses your computer is gonna have to start working more because it's trying to process so make sure you, you know you just you choose which one you want and that way your computer can handle not everybody can handle a custom house but for those of you whose computers can hello hello <laughs> handle a custom house then you know I suggest you download a few because they're they're fucking nice. All right, so I'm very picky. I should have just chose a house and was like, "Buy." Oh, okay. Here we go. This looks like some nice stairs. Here we go. What is this? Artillier? Oh, Artinus. I can't read. Clearly, I cannot read. Okay, this house is base game compatible. So I'll do like one base game and I'll do one fully C. Thank you. This one, y'all didn't hear, but a fucking ad just started auto playing in my ear. I was like, what the hell is that? That's why I don't like coming to Sims Resource. I'm sorry. I know they need to get their coins, but this is not it. Having like 6,000 ads in my face is not it. Okay, it is not it. Ooh. How about Modern House? I believe there's like a lot of places they've called Modern House. I like Modern House 1, Modern House... Let's keep looking and looking and looking. Alright, so yeah. Ooh, that's pretty. I like that headboard. Okay. This looks like to be a base game. A little bit of base game. So I'm like getting irritated. I don't want to come here anymore. But if I went to SS's Vitlands or anywhere else, they probably would have redirected me here. They probably fucking up. Ooh, look at this townhouse. All right, so here we go. Hopefully this isn't base game. It looks like there is some base. Yeah, this one is base game itself. Maybe I think they're going more base game. Really, to be honest. But it's just does. It's not marked as base game. Maybe maybe just forgot to say that it is base game. I like my houses pre-made, so that way I sometimes you know once you decorate a couple of houses you. You're good with your life, okay? You're just good. And ooh, cozy autumn. That looks so pretty. I remember I downloaded a house just for my seasons LP. Because the house was gorgeous. Alright, we're gonna get cozy autumn too. And we're gonna download Eternus. Eternus. Alright, so make sure you check the description, creator notes, base game, no CC. So we're good to go. We can go ahead and just download this house. Alright, so let's go ahead and download Cozy Autumn. So, creator's notes, EP, so some of the stuff you do need some expansion packs for. Get to work, get together, city living, cats and dogs, and seasons. Along with having some CC in here, which Haley Sims does link. So, make sure you guys check the description to see where it's linked. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and just download a couple of pieces, just so, just to show you guys. Actually, I'll download everything. You know what? Why not? Uh, did I already get this one? I hope not. What is this one? Okay, I don't think I did. Now, some of the pieces that Pearly Sims does use, they use them in other builds. So, if you don't have your CC folder organized, which I highly suggest you go and do, I'll leave how I help, how I have my organizing description box below. But go do it. Like, you would love yourself so much more if you did it, alright? 
and it tells you the lot size but you know who cares about the lot size you can put it anywhere i'm gonna go ahead and download the file now if you haven't noticed when you download cc houses do you have to download the house files and the mods separately like the how when you download the house it's not gonna have all the cc that comes with it all right they're not supposed careers are not supposed to do that so don't expect them to do that all right if they do that they're not supposed to hey boo how you doing so welcome to my desktop how you doing where we're going to go ahead and just open what we have so if you don't know how to install mods and cc please go ahead and check out the video I have for that so right there but I'm gonna quickly just go ahead and unzip all of these files real quick uh you know right files using 7-zip things like that if you're completely lost join my discord I'll leave this link in the description box below it will always be pinned on my channel art on my youtube channel so we can always get in if you need to. Uh, we will give you mod help, CC help, ask you some questions, give you some CC, and you'll always find other simmers to interact with if you know you're tired of showing yourself your screenshots and your bills and you want to show other people. So yeah, you can go ahead and do that. Alright, so first thing you need to do when you're installing these houses is you go into your of course, electronic arts, the Sims 4 game that is currently active. Uh, delete the local thumb cache as I always told you and you go into your tray folder now the tray folder houses all of the sims files and houses files even if you download from the gallery this is where they go so you will take the actually let's do this make it so much easier guys can see it hi how are you I like having the dark theme okay with the pink all right leave me alone all right, so here I have the house for cozy autumn 2. I'm going to take all of this and I'm going to move it on over. And then I'm going to take Artemis. I'm going to take all of this and I'm going to move it on over. And then that's it. I am done putting the houses in. Now it's time to put in the actual custom content for the cozy autumn 2. So what I like to do is at first I like to just go ahead and just type in code the name of the house. And, you know, if I actually like it in game, I'll go back to it and put it in a, you know, put it where it needs to be if I don't already have the, um, the CC for it. So I'm going to go through all of this. Hi. How you doing? Uh, if you want to learn how to put in custom content and, well, mods and shit into your game, please check out that video. I pretty, I know damn well I already have these Praline Sims walls decals in my game. Um, I used to download Praline Sims religiously, so I already know I have those in my game. So I will have to come back and delete those duplicates. But here goes. Take all the seats. All right, and I am done with that. I'm going to go ahead and close this out. Close this out, and I'm going ahead and load up my game. All right, guys, welcome to my game. So I'm going to go ahead and get into my gallery. This is where your custom content builds go. They go into your library. So what you're going to do is you're going to click custom content, and you're going to click uh lots it's okay so i'm gonna look for the house so here's cozy autumn and here is a turnus so i'm gonna go ahead and put cozy autumn down as you can see praline the real praline um a four and a four it gives you all the stuff it's 125 yeah it, it costs a lot it, it costs a grip so i'm gonna find a lot for it to go on and usually just go into newcrest because you know newcrest this has everything i'm gonna throw it on down furnished yes and let it build. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and put down a turn this as well, just because. And I'm gonna put it, I guess, right across the, it's a 40 by 30. Yeah, I think it's a 40 by 30. I'll put it like right across this. All right, there you go. And if I didn't mention it, anything with the custom content and CC for your game goes into your mods folders. I think I probably didn't mention it. I probably just showed you guys, but yeah, that's where it goes. Like all the furniture that goes inside the house goes into your mods folder. All right, let's go ahead and move a household in. Um, really quickly, I'm going to just get my sim self, you know, why the hell not? I'm going to do free real estates on, and now I can afford this house, and we're going to move on in. Welcome to Cozy Autumn, the seat house that was downloaded. Alright, so shout out to Praley Sims. Praley Sims does some dope ass builds, and as you can see, the CC we got, we went ahead and we downloaded. I'm clearly missing something because the wallpaper isn't here. I probably forgot. That's what happens. Make sure you have, you download everything. I knew I forgot something because like the amount I had already clicked on and the amount that was already downloading was kind of off. So I was expecting something to be missing. So yeah, here are the CC 
couches for the living room and the kitchen. This bathroom has a mixture. We know damn well this is not in the game and this tub is not in the game as well. Um, I'm missing some... Am I missing some bedroom stuff? I think I am. I'm missing like maybe one bedroom thing, but here's another bedroom. That is, you know, furnished, just missing the wallpaper and shit. So yeah, make sure you download everything you really want the house. And this is a great way to get furniture, CC furniture. If you don't really want to go and individually download furniture, and you don't, know, well I mean you have to individually download it, but like, you don't want to go search for it, just download some CC houses and you'll all make the furniture. You just gotta make sure you don't have like duplicates in. That's how you download and install a CC house with the Sims 4 guys. And of course across the street is the other house. Hi, how you doing? We can already see it's you know what it needs to be because it was a base game. It was a base game house but you know it was just actually done. Nicely, nicely done. So guys don't forget to like and subscribe to your girl's channel. I hope to see you later. Let me know in the comments below what the other tutorial I should be doing that I have not done already. Make sure you check my CC 101 playlist and I'll see y'all next time. Bye boo.